This is a potential first round meeting in the Stanley Cup playoffs, which would be bad news for the Calgary Flames. They've dropped 24 straight games in Anaheim. Opening period, Andrew Cagliano puts the puck on goal. Chad Johnson makes what looks to be a routine save, but shortly after that, Johnson signals to the Flames bench. He wants the trainers who come out and take a look at the Flames tender. The news not good as Johnson leaves with a lower body injury, Brian Elliott is in. Later, Mark Giordano is going to let the point shot go. John Gibson makes the save, but Michael Backlund is there to put home the rebound, his 22nd of the season. Good start for the Flames. They lead it one zip after 20 to the second, where before a faceoff, Ryan Getzlaff talking strategy with Patrick Eves. Does it pay off? The answer is yes. Off the draw, Getzlaff throws it right on net. Eves buries the rebound. He's got 31. We are tied at one later. Kevin Bieksa with the slap shot. It squeaks through Elliott. Bieksa gets his third of the season. Ducks doing what they do at home against the Flames, taking the lead. It's 2-1 to the third, and that's when things would get physical. Cam Fowler coming over the line, lets the shot go, and gets hit knee on knee by Mark Giordano. Fowler down in a ton of pain, and this is not a good sight for the Ducks as the defenseman Needed help off the ice later. Josh Manson seeking out Giordano, perhaps some retaliation. I would say so. Those two drop the gloves and Manson's gonna connect with a big uppercut on the Flames captain. Later, more physical play. Corbinian Holzer lining up the rookie, Matthew Kachuk. That could have been very dangerous. Then later, Matt Bartkowski comes to the rookie's defense. He drops the gloves. Meanwhile, Kessler wants a piece of Michael Froelich. These two teams need to meet in the opening round. The bad blood is boiling, as in the end, the Ducks beat the Flames at home again.